The deal, which is still subject to approval by the Namibian Competition Commission, NACC, was announced by the two companies in Ventuk yesterday. The multi-million dollar transaction allows MTN Business Namibia, which was previously 100% owned by the MTN Group, to have a local empowerment partner in Profile Technologies, a company with local expertise in the Namibian ICT sector. After the deal, Profile Technologies will cease to operate as an independent entity and will be merged into the operations of MTN Business Namibia. So you are looking at a, a partnership that has got a win-win situation. And it's a partnership that has the strength to face competition, not just in Namibia, but regionally, by virtue of the fact that it is, it is got, it's underpinned by MTN Group. So I do not foresee a situation where you will have a, um, a, a, what you, if I may call them failures in this case, because we, we're talking about a, a global brand. Director of MTN Business Namibia, Elia Torus, says the deal will result in an increased service basket of information, communications, technology, products and services to the market. So when you bring two organizations of the likes of Profile Technologies and MTN, Business Namibia, there are always cost efficiencies that result in uh, um, you know services to the consumer. Um, at the end of the day, the additional services that we're providing uh, to the market um, as a result of our uh, joint partnership um, also uh, basically allows us to deliver products and services that are not available in the market at the moment. Speaking on behalf of the Minister of Information and Communications Technology Permanent Secretary Mbeuta Uwanjarakana says innovative ways such as this to drive economic development are needed in Namibia. Through Harambe Prosperity Plan, many milestones have been set and achieving them would require players like you to make them a reality. The importance of your participation in the Namibian economy, especially at this difficult stage where scarcity of finances has become a major talking point, can never be overemphasized. The new company, which will trade as MTN Namibia, will result in profile investment holdings taking up two board seats, while the remaining three seats are taken up by representatives of the MTN group.